This conference will now be recorded. Okay. So before starting the demo, I just introduce myself, myself Neha. I have a 10 year uh, 10 years of IT experience. I worked in the different organizations. And after that, uh, I work as a freelance in the SAS. Uh, right. I work in base SAS, advanced SAS, clinical SAS, SBI, business intelligence tool, and DI data integration. And same uh, I uh, use for uh, this freelance work. Then we uh, I started the training as well. So in the training only I'm covering those module which real time I worked and I do have the experience. Right. So during the training I provide the uh, tools where you have to work and uh, the uh, you know uh, data sets which I am using for uh, um, uh, training that I will share with you and uh, some of the exercise also you have to perform. So before yeah, starting this, yeah, if you have any uh, question for my uh, career, you can so, ask. Uh, yeah, one, one thing is that uh, can, you, can you share some of the, uh, like some of the uh, uh, projects that you worked on? No, because uh, because uh, I'm looking for a real time experience. Like, yeah, yeah, actually what happened? I can convey my experience by the example, but the same project because the data I cannot take it from the company. Uh -huh. and, no, no, I totally uh, understand. Yeah, I'm, I'm just in, asking you to share the project experience. That's it. Uh, project means uh, resume uh, and all that I will share where you can get the projects of DI. Fine, fine. And right. whatever you worked uh, means base as advanced as same thing we are doing in DI. There right. everything we are writing the code and all here 80% uh, uh, drag and drop. 20% yeah. coding is there and mostly coding on the proc SQL and macro and yeah. uh, procedures. Uh, no doubt it's there. So some customized work you have to uh, write the code by yourself. Uh -huh. Otherwise. Uh -huh. uh, normally things are available in drag and drop all right no i understand okay. see the the most important thing that i i am concerned about you know uh, is that uh, if if uh, i if someone asks me how how do you use to get data so i should be able to tell them like this is this was the flow you know because you're yeah, saying sure. that you had the real time experience so if someone's asked me where were the uh, data files like uh, where do you use to get the data from so mm -hmm. i should should be able to tell them that okay so the the file were in server or was on a local uh, you know whatever so i yeah. sh should be able to tell them like uh, yeah, so how we are getting the file in base and advances, those are the text file or Excel yeah. file or Axis uh -huh. file or Oracle yeah. file or SAS data yeah. set. Same yes. way for the DI, different projects okay. we are getting the database by the different uh, uh, database. And then right. we have to fetch. So I will let you know how to fetch the data, create the SAS uh -huh. data set. I mean, whatever your basic concept in the SAS, no? entering uh -huh. the data, create the SAS data set. Yeah. Then do, yeah. uh, using some uh, procedures and using some technique for manipulation. Same thing is here, but All here right. it's okay. easy because drag and drop. Yeah. A lot of uh, yeah. functionalities are available which you can use and you know speed up the job. Uh, I understand. And schedule as well. So whenever you want to run, you no need to manually run because in base okay. says what we need to do manually, we have to run it, right? Here yeah. we can schedule. We have uh, it will come and uh, automatically, and it will come uh, with the mail also that your job is successful. Kind of okay. uh, you know very uh, uh, automated user friendly automation yeah. is there, which help okay. you for working on lot of project in same time. Okay, okay, I okay. understand. Fine. So I just start with the simple introduction about the BI. Uh, NDI. Later okay. on, we will move to the tool. Sure. So, business intelligence is the art of gaining a business advantage from data by ask, answering the fundamental question, such as how various customers rank, how, how business is doing now, and see what happened. Customer is coming. They have their own query. They are coming with a lot of questions. They are giving us the data. 
and we uh -huh. have the tool uh, you we will use that tool to answering the question which comes from the client okay, okay. for answering the question we are using the different technique or different tools okay because whatever uh, uh, you know uh, question they are asking and i am giving the answer of that question based on that they are taking the decision of their organizations and uh, they want to improve the profitability or reduce the cost that all are the goal for uh, data analysis okay ah. so they are providing us the raw data we have some bi tool dibi tool using that we can provide the meaningful information that information going to management they take some action and after that we get more profitability increase revenue and reduce the cost and uh, organization stability okay so for uh, getting this all profit they uh, ask us because if they have uh, suppose two three four millions of the data to see the data they cannot come to any conclusion for coming to conclusion they want consolidate it and analyze data that data comes from our tool so whatever we are providing them data or the reports those are based on the fact okay it's not assumption because yeah. business not going based on the assumption it is going based on the fact so that yeah. based on the data we will provide the report it is based on the fact Okay. so here first step what we are doing we are just uh, fetching the data from mm -hmm. different databases uh, performing etl process extract transfer and load yeah. and uh, using the etl process we will uh, uh, convert data into data mart data mart is the final data after manipulation which required for the analysis Right. okay data step we are using no so what we are doing in the data step almost same thing we are doing in the sas di yeah but here we do have procedures also but we can do whatever we are doing data step now presenting the report we have different bi tool like eg enterprise guide we mm -hmm. have uh, olap qv studio information delivery delivery portal information maps web report studio so many different tools are there every tool have their own utility yeah so uh, we are uh, sending the data to those tool and those tool are working uh, whatever the uh, functionality is in built inside that based on that it, they are giving the output then they uh, those output we are sending to statisticians the statisticians will uh, read that data we are the uh, report writer they are the report reader so whatever output is coming they are reading the they find out what is going good what is going wrong and based on that they are giving some information uh, required information to customer and based on that customer will take decision okay yeah so here when we are talking about the sas bi and di tool all the tools are connected into central metadata repository central metadata repository is the common place where all the two uh, all the data is available which is uh, which we save in any of the tool so okay. here we do have uh, one tool called management console management console is the admin tool admin tool means administrative tool all the users we have to register which user need which author authority authorization label which software they can access which report they can access job scheduling and each and everything which is required with the uh, management of the software and the people are available in the management console okay. now after that data is coming for says di di stand for data integration it integrate the data from different databases convert into uh, uh, constant value or uh, uh, the data which is uh, usable for the further analysis and yes. here we have uh, different transformations are there if you work on informatica informatica also etl tool and there also we do have the transformation the functionality which provided by the tool it's called the transformation 
so we will come to that and after that uh, uh, doing after doing everything we are creating the data marts that data marts we supply in other uh, ses tool and based on the requirement we are working on it so here all the tools are not uh, used by the organization combination of tool they are using some organizations are using only eg enterprise guide some organization is using only di data integration some yeah. are using di and olap combinations some are using um, enterprise guide and uh, lab or somewhere information map studio itself they are working in web report studio so this is the combination of different different tools so whatever tool i will uh, okay in the bi what are the tools are there every tool is uh, means all together will not work out combination is working out so for preparation of the data we have information map studio lab cube studio display data we have web report studio bi dashboard information delivery portal add in microsoft helper tool eg enterprise guide is stored procedure and prompt framework and admin tool is uh ses management so yeah okay so this is the flow of the data we are sending the data to ses di data integration after that etl extract transfer and load happen and the mart is created of this data mart is uh, validate data clean uh, new column created of all the uh, you know manipulation done then it is coming to other tool for reporting purpose so all the tools are connected to each other okay yeah. so this is more about the ses bi but if you are interested in bi let, uh, let me come to the tool this is the tool for ses di data integration yeah. 4.23 so here we have different transformations some transformation for accessing the data some transformation for analysis of the data some transformation for change data capture controlling loops and all is there and main transformation is data sql join set operators compare tables data validations scd type 1 scd type 2 so everything first i will explain you the concept then uh -huh. uh, i will take uh, uh, data to explain uh, practically how to work in which situation what transformation is required sure. then we have yeah. user return uh, code and user return transformation that is the place where you have to write the code by yourself otherwise yeah. other thing is just choose the transformation use your value and you can done yeah so uh, that will be there and data quality i'm not covering that is data flex another 30 days training it is it is using yeah. for data quality data flex is something uh, we we have been you know uh, some of the some of the companies are asking about this data flex also Yeah, oh, data flex. Uh, yeah. I didn't work on data flex. It is for quality check purpose. Yeah, yeah. So they they have they will uh, you know transform the columns to standardized data, right? If we mm -hmm. have a address address column and if it is like not uh, uh, standard, uh, you know, it will it will create another column that is uh, standard output, right? For the address and the pin code, the street street address, something like this. yeah yeah data quality uh, purpose make the quality based on the standard we are using okay. this transformation okay so, so we will be covering this uh, data flux this part. only data uh, quality i will not cover we are data okay. flux is there then output publish everything i will cover so okay. during my training i will let you know how to import the data this is the training on another uh, uh, you know A batch there how to okay. import the source data create the files here important is jobs how to create the jobs uh -huh. so here i will take the data and i will take the uh, take the help of the transformations and uh, i will let you know how to use that transformation for performing the task uh -huh. like uh, one example sql set so we have uh, four set statement 
So how to use the set statement with different scenario. Uh -huh. So here uh, we have the data of one uh, company called Orion Star. Uh, says uh, company also using the same data that is the uh, free data for everyone. So yeah. using that data, we have uh, Orion Star company data where all the information about the order, purchase, customer, employee, everything is there. So we okay. use that data and uh, use the transformation to convert the data from non-standard to standard format. Okay. And and then validation, validate the data, clean the data. If data is coming from multiple uh, way, we have to join the data left, right, uh, outer joins, all SQL related joins are available. So this all I will take it with the example. So it will help you out for a real time scenario how to work on it. So that in that way, I will give you the training. So I will give the access of this virtual machine as well as I will uh, share the uh, data, whatever I will use during the training. And then you can do it by yourself as well, whatever yeah. we are doing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, so that will be there. Then some interview questions are there, which I will provide you some resume of TI. I will provide you. Okay. So, um, you know, uh, what uh, if I may ask, what is your background? Because, uh, you know, uh, basically for the, for the interview purposes, uh, I, I will be focusing on uh, banking and finance domain. So, uh, you know, what, uh, okay, what is my background? Uh, background is more on uh, logistic, clinical. supply chain and clinical. All right. Okay. So uh, it, it doesn't matter, right? Uh, what, yeah, it doesn't what, matter because yeah. see, already you worked on SAS, right? Whatever yeah, yeah. scenario you handle in that time, same uh -huh. scenario you can convey by this functionality. Sure, sure. Yeah, there is nothing which is different. Base SAS means this is a masterpiece. Okay, everything you can do in the basis. But yeah, here yeah. we have limited transformations are there. Moreover, you have to write the coding so if yeah. you work on already work on basis you can uh, correlate that basis with di and you can uh, show that scenario whatever you worked on and you can okay. use the same data if you have and by mm -hmm. the di you can do the practice by yourself as well yeah makes sense yeah okay so in this okay. way because if you work in sas no there is no problem to getting the job in bidi and all uh -huh. because yeah. you know all the concept you know how to work what is the uh, you know capacity of the sas and all then yes, you yes. have to just implement that in the this tool and it is uh, faster than the basis uh, faster in the sense how user friendly it is they are each and every code we have to write here nothing we need to write everything is on background uh, coming only 20 yeah. percent something which is not available we have to customize right right okay, okay. any other question uh not for now. No, I'm. I think I'm good. Um, so uh, all the data that will be uh, we will be using uh, will all all be you know uh, this uh, the the data that has that are preloaded into SAS, right? The the free uh, data. Actually, it is not preloaded data. Uh, I'm not taking SASL dot uh, data uh -huh. like yeah. class and all. I'm not using yeah, yeah. that one. Uh, as I told you, we have different uh, set of data of the organization, which is the uh -huh. shared data. It is not the All secure right. data. This is the shared data that I will okay. provide you. Whatever I work, okay. I will provide you that data. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, that's that my uh, my point. You know, uh, can you can you provide all those data to us? Right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, sure. Sure. So Whatever I will teach you, uh, you can do by yourself for the practice purpose. Sure. Okay. Anything else? Okay. Uh, so uh, I believe uh, you you told me uh, you have already covered five classes for the batch that is yeah. running right now. Yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, 
we should be able to manage right in that way. so uh, are we or planning to tell me, yeah yeah or else uh, you tell me your availability so based on that like right uh, like today you are available so if any day you are available in uh, afternoon time then uh -huh. i can take the class like that this uh, the afternoon session works perfectly well for me 